Hi, I'm an intelligent, fun-loving person working in a reputed company. I regularly surf the internet and I'm very active on social media. One day, Mr. Funga suffers from red circular rashes with itching and irritation. I'm not feeling good. Mr. Funga tries to find a solution from the internet, social media and his social circle. Mr. Funga Googles how to cure red and circular skin rashes, asks around his friends and family circle. Mr. Funga stares at four possible solutions. General physician, dermatologist, pharmacy shops and family members. Mr. Funga visits his nearest dermatologist. Mr. Funga consults the dermatologist and shares his symptoms. The dermatologist prescribes oral antifungal for 14 days and topical antifungal for 30 days. Dermatologist also advises Mr. Funga on proper hygiene habits and other precautionary measures to ensure quicker recovery. During the course of treatment, Mr. Funga follows doctor's instructions. Occasional bathing, regular bathing and body cleansing, wearing clothes immediately after bath. Before wearing clothes, drying out the groin area to prevent excess moisture. Wearing tight jeans, leggings and jeggings. Wearing loose fitting clothes. Using towel used by other members of the family. Not to share your towel with other family members. Washing personal clothes with other family members clothes. Laundering clothes of infected person in hot water and washing with antiseptic agent. Wearing clothes dried under the fan. Drying clothes in sunlight for at least two hours. Wearing clothes without ironing them. Wearing clothes after ironing them and placing them separately. Scratching on lesions and not washing hands. Washing your hands with antiseptic and water frequently to prevent spread of infection. Keeping hair, nail and scalp filthy. Keeping hair, nails and scalp clean. Walking barefoot in public places. Wearing well-ventilated shoes with cotton socks. Sharing comb and other utilities with other family members. Not sharing comb and other utilities with other family members. Eating unhealthy food. Eating healthy food which boosts immunity. Drinking less water. Drinking two to three liters of water every day. After seven days, Mr. Funga is happy to see that the drugs give good results and his infection is almost gone. He considers discontinuing the course. Discontinuation of medication halfway may lead to relapse of infection. Complete the course to avoid turning simple infections into extensive and difficult to treat infections. Mr. Funga's brother also incurs a fungal infection. Mr. Funga considers giving him the same medication prescribed by his dermatologist. Mr. Funga gives his brother his prescription. However, he remembers his doctor's instructions. Never share your medication with others as every infection is different with regards to severity and form. It could make the other person's condition worse. He advises his brother to visit a dermatologist for a personal consultation. After 30 days, Mr. Funga is fully cured and is thankful to doctor for guiding him to a healthy and happy recovery. Here is a summary of do's and don'ts during a fungal infection.